Hello readers and writers, today we're going to talk about suffixes. A suffix is a group of letters with a specific meaning attached to the end of a root word, and the suffix gives the root word a new meaning. I'm going to do our suffix sound cards. Please say them along with me at home. N-E-S-S, ness. -S. It means the quality of or state of being. So if something has the quality of being dark, it would have darkness. E-N-N, -N, it means made of. So if something is made of gold, it is golden. F-U-L, full, it means full of. So when you are full of help, you are helpful. L-E-S-S, -S, less, it means without. So if something is without pain, it is painless. L-Y, li, this means like or in the manner of. So if something is like or in the manner of love, it is lovely. Suffix y, pronounced e, it means full of or the quality of. So if something has the quality of being like soap, it is soapy. Ed, ed, it is the past tense of action verbs and it has three different pronunciations. You can say ed, ed as in founded. You can say ed, d, as in opened, and you can say ed, t, as in jumped. Ish, ish, it's the quality of. So if something has the quality of being like a baby, it is babyish. Ment, mint, it is the result of an action. So if you take an action to improve, you have made improvements. I-N-G, ing, it is the action in the present tense. So if you are going to jump, if you are jumping in the present, it is jumping. E-R-R, -er, this is a person or a thing. So someone who teaches is a teacher. It can also mean more than. So if something is more soft than something else, you could say it's softer. E-S-T-S. -S, it means the most. So if you want to say that something was the most warm, you would say it is the warmest. 